Hello everyone, it's Jirobro back with you another video. We're gonna be talking about the upcoming feature for uh, for Jira, which is all about when you have the changes when a parent field can be edited. So what actually this means? This actually means that the uh, parent field that you're actually that there is uh, on your project it will be visible but not edible. So let us begin with a problem here. So it says for uh, for issues in a company managed project, Jira administrators are able to configure screens for the free issue operation, create issue, view issue, and edit issue. Yes, this is uh, this is of course right because every screen can have uh, free operations. When you're of course creating the issue, that is the very first that is the very first screen where well when you actually click on the create and you also have the edit issue when you're actually editing some of the field or you're actually adding a comment as well that is also being considered to be an editing of the issue so it says for most fields if a field is not configured on a screen for the edit issue operation users are unable to edit the field for the issue. The parent field does not follow this rule. The parent field is editable regardless of screen configuration. So this, this right here, this was a, uh, this was actually a bug that was reported by the users. And if we actually go here, it says parent field to respect edit issue configuration. So this was a, uh, this was actually, well selected and as you can see for the symptom severity so the severity is two so this is like a major one so this is actually something that is kind of well you can say like critical and the proposed solution for this is in order to resolve the bug so the following experiences will be changed when the parent field is not on the screen configured for the edit issue operation. So you have the issue view where it says the parent will be visible but not, okay, this right here, but not editable. And the edit issue metadata REST API will not return the parent field in the response. If you're using the... Uh, API. Uh, I will also leave the link in the description for this one. So impact on new and existing projects. So this, this now what happens with the already existing ones? So it says there are many Jira users with the existing company managed projects where the parent field is not on the screen configured for the edit issue operation. Yes. In order to avoid changes in the parent field behavior for these projects, the parent field will be added to the screen configured for the edit operation for existing company managed projects. So in here for the issue view, it says editing the parent in the breadcrumb of the issue view. So actually this is, this is how it's basically before. This is how you're actually having it. And this is what is going to be it says tooltip shows the parent is not editable in the breadcrumb. It says you can't edit the parent of this issue. And it will basically tell you that you cannot do it. So as you can see in here, you can change the parent where you're actually having this pencil icon, but it will be replaced with this cancel icon where this will not be possible. So editing the parent in the parent field in the issue view. So this is how it looks right now. Well, the parent field is not editable in the parent field. So this is actually when you create your issue and you have like, uh, when you're viewing your issue and you're having, uh, you're having all of these fields appearing. And of course there will, and there is also a parent field in here. And it's in here it says that is not going to be editable at all so you cannot basically do it now it's actually kind of possible but in the future it won't be and for the edit issue metadata 
REST API. It says it will not return the parent field in the response if it's not configured all this on the screen for the edit issue operation. So, so this is uh, how the response actually uh, looks like. So you have the parent field where you, do, you where it's not required, where it's basically optional. You also have this schema right here. And for the system, it says that basically this is a parent field because parent field is considered to be a system field. So now you also have the name and the parent it doesn't have the default value so it's again false and then you have for the schema the type is string and system is for the environment and now if you like uh, look at it actually an example response for after so required false operation set environment required so there's going to be much less response than there there is right now. Yeah, those are the upcoming changes uh, that will actually take on. I will let's scroll up. So the resolve date is actually on the seventeenth of June, twenty twenty four. So this should be the date when this will be actually available uh, for the users and actually it's pretty good and looking good looking good so far so it will actually give the admins more more control when it comes to more res restrictions all right uh, so that is it guys uh, don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel I will see you guys in the next video bye bye